And you remember these back in the day? 901s. Oh. My, uh, my, uh, my brother-in-law had a pair of these. These things crank and they're very desirable and they still sell for good money. We're back. Oz here with George on the camera. Teddy Dog finds we did it again. This thing, <laughs> this thing is sick. I mean, we're, we've had a good run the last few months, right? Yeah, I think it's like, been we're just scoring, fantastic. Like, scoring. This year's been great. You need to watch the videos. You need to subscribe and watch people. It's insane. We've been scoring. And really weird, unique stuff. We tell you the truth. I am the voice of reason. <laughs> I, I will tell you exactly what's going on, and I'm good at what I do. Check this one out. Let's get to it. I've heard this one pretty good. No trash. Oh, those are the best this ones. Is, this is why you go to every auction, because if you don't, you miss stuff like this. And another reason is sometimes nobody shows up. And yeah. Score. Yeah, you get lucky weather something and just the people stay home. Oh, Bam! This is a big one. Oh, dude, not a lick of trash. Wow, everything's boxed and... And if you stay tuned, I'm gonna tell you how much I paid for it, which I paid a good price, but I scored. Look at this, isn't this crazy? Speakers, records, 45, generators, tools, survival food in the back. I, I'll admit it. I will eat my neighbors. I'm not letting my kids die. I'll, I'm just gonna be honest. My superpowers being honest, Oh yeah, you can see it in the fishing back. poles. It goes on and on and on, man. This is the legit thing. Yeah, like a serious survivalist or nice camper. Nice compressor or... right there, probably used for roughing or something. Wow. Check this out. This is an old picture of Hollywood signed. Oh, is that what that is? They're all solid, like Western. Yeah, and... Dennis O'Keefe. There's some famous people in here. I think Bill, Wild Bill Elliott or something. Or not. Roy Rogers is up here. He's my dad's favorite. Look at it. Wow. Find some famous ones in here. Yeah, they're freaking great, didn't it? Isn't Sign this cool? too. This has got to be something. So this is gonna tell you what's going on in this room. There's gonna be some memorabilia in here. Yeah, like a Western, yeah, that makes so sense. So I'm going to pause for just one second because there's some noise back there, but also I'm gonna pull out some of these uh, frames so we can, so we can get a better look. Space. Yeah. So we'll be right back in one second. We're back. I cleared just a little room here. Let's start with these speakers. Damn! Bose, baby. Oh, they aren't Those are 401 corner speakers. And you remember these back in the day? 901s. Wow, these are old. My uh, my, uh, my brother-in-law had a pair of these. These things crank, and they're very desirable, and they still sell for good money. Really? Yeah, they're I know the Bose They're just a little stuff, dusty, a little toasty, but Jennifer! other than that, they look great. And then these, I've never seen these before. I love this pattern on the front. This is straight seven. What are they called? Wharfdale 70s. Wharfdale 70s. These things are heavy, baby, heavy. That means there's probably a, a serious uh, speaker in there with a magnet on it, you know? I love that logo and it's just the design. These things are, are super heavy, man. These are the real deal. Wow. So I'm going to, I want you to see if you can cop these. And find it, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm sure these speakers are 300 bucks all day long if they're not 500. Wow. Because they're closed. And I have no idea about these. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna say there's $500 in speakers. Just right a while, yeah, yeah. Right. Safe. Nice comp uh, air compressor here. Extra. Heck, look, there's there's two generators, man. Troy built 3550. There's an Onan in here. These oh, are wow. like those are ones that I think they usually use these smaller ones, like when you 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 know your RV and stuff. Oh yeah, put it out. I yeah. bet you in this day and age that's. 500 bucks. I know generators that's can be expensive. probably three to $500. And I'm sure that's 150, 200 bucks. You got a grand right here, baby. Yeah, I think that's safe. I love this room. Tools everywhere. Let's walk in a little deeper. This one is records. Oh, sneaking right here records, behind us. man. Look, little 45 old record 
Oh, uh, is that what those things are? Yeah, these are... I love that pink color. <laughs> yeah, these are great. These are old, like, little record uh, boxes. They're all sleeved, too. I've, we usually get them sometimes, but they're all loose. Well, and... you can buy the sleeves, which is what this guy did. Probably buy them and just sleeved them. Some Keeps of them, everything nice. Some originals or some just purchased sleeves. Mm -hmm. That's to take care of them. But we'll have to go through and see what kind of records they are real quick. All kinds of old pictures and things. Oh, yeah. All vintage black and whites. God. Some memorabilia. Is that Buck Owen? That is. I don't have any idea. Wow. What with this. Um, that would line up with the country kind of western. More frames, more pictures. It looked like something did some framing. Uh, so these got extra cases. Oh man, that's a for CDs. Right and of now. course, if you watch my other videos, I've scored some CDs. So um, there's probably. I love some... those things. So check this out. Oh, this is gold, all you guys, all you mechanics. Water? Check that out. What is that? That's some sort of this, two spikes on the this end. This thing is heavy. It almost looks like um I you guys will know. Tell me what it is. It's like yeah. some kind of an anvil, some kind of like a shoe or animal or I mean this thing is heavy. Yeah, let us know in the comments for sure. I've never seen something like I bet that. you anything I can get a hundred bucks for that. I don't, yeah, I've never seen stuff. one. I've never seen that before. Yeah, That's, for sure. Let us know, guys. This weighs at least twenty-five pounds, and That's it might heavy. it might be thirty-five. Wow. That's cool. So there's going to be some fun oddities in here. Yeah, the stuff we don't know. We love looking that stuff up, and you guys can help us even better. <laughs> so you know, I'm a I'm a record guy. So let's see what kind of records we got here. It looks like some older stuff because I see Doris, Doris Day. Day yeah. That's not my jam, but. Sometimes the old stuff can be good. Let's turn it around. There's a collector for everything. You just gotta find them. Wailing songs, Moby Dick. Uh oh. What? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that's a new ex Walmart exclusive reprint. Sun Records. Yeah. What the? Or it's just in a Walmart sleeve. Mm, no. Yeah, this that's is... a Walmart one. Oh, it's. Oh my God. It's a cool reprint. Yeah. The ultimate collection, yeah. It's got all of the old timers mm -hmm. on it. Yeah, it's what nice. an interesting reprint for Walmart. I bet you these were thirty, thirty-five dollars. That's when you go there. I think their standard price is thirty to forty and bucks. Somebody mounted it in the back of this. Probably how they shipped it. it looks like somebody shipped it to them. I, yeah, I, you probably. I don't think you'd see that in stores, but you could get it online probably. Let's see what we got down here. That's a cool record, though. Surfing. <laughs> Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Ricky Nelson, good. Ricky Nelson. Connie Stevens, and some older stuff, yeah, Frankie cool. Avalon. This is oh, a guy God. that's into the 50s and 60s. Mm -hmm. Crash, Patty Duke, Let's see if we can find anything really cool in here. I mean, I sell these all day long for three to five bucks. Some will be 10. I mean, that one's probably 20, 30 dollar record. Just some funky stuff. Yeah. Diana Ross. Okay, that's different. Look at this. Look at this. Johnny Horton. Drink Price. Just a wow. weird collection. Let's see what else we got. If there's something else up here. Elvis Presley. Greatest Hits. There's more Elvis down there. There's some Elvis. Coming away. <laughs> Christmas with Colonel Quack. Sanders. That could be worth something. I love that. Just because of the collector's That's value. That's hilarious. Wow, that could be cool. We gotta look that up. Eddie Arnold. Eddie Arnold. Old school. Oh, the time machine. Is that the? Uh, that's a laser disc. Huh. That's a movie of the original time machine. That's a really good movie. Good. Yeah. That's one of my favorite old timey movies. Yeah. A laser disc of all things. There's something you don't see some today. box sets of something. More some art. More framework stuff. Huh. Or ready to be framed. Wow. Yeah. Well, we could always use that too. Let's look a little different. 78. Oh, yeah. Okay. Bluebird. There might be some rock and roll 78s in here. So even rock and roll 78s. Can be worse. Oh, there was one. Rock and roll 78. Little Richard. Oh. I bet you that's 20 bucks online. Okay, yeah, that's cool. If they're rock and roll 78s, they can be worth 5 to 30, 40 bucks. If they're mm. rare, they could be worth hundreds. 
This is a rock and roll 78. Look at that. Interesting Some of them. What a collection! This will be uh, this will be a project, folks. I'll have yeah. to go through and just you know spend hours going through and trying to find what is good and what is not. Yeah, separating things and all of these. It's forty five. Oh, there's a there's Buck, Buck Owens. Owens hot dog. Bakersfield Sound. Oh no, this is great. No, hot a... dog. That's his favorite. Oh man. Great. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got a poison. I see poison, so I stucy rock. Look at that. Talk dirty to me. We, oh, we got some. Jumping Jack Flash. Hee <laughs> oh, We got some different stuff in this here. This is, now we're getting to some really wild That's stuff. the police. Oh, cool. More Buck. Merle, Merle Haggard, yeah. She did jog. Morning, hilarious. East LA. Watch my lips. Where were you born? I was born in East LA, man. I was born in East LA. Look at wow, this. All over the place. All over the place. Somebody was selling this stuff. Madonna. Oh, look at that one. Yeah. She's got the gun. That's great. Billy Preston, the fifth Beatle. That's right. Elvis, the tremolos. Okay, this is going to be good, folks. Wow, there's going to be some um, fun stuff. There's some sellable merch in here. And what I love about this is the old 60s holders, cases. So that the color on that, that is so cool. Super desirable. They're not worth a ton of money. But here's the thing. I have a space at Antique Mall, and these will fly down. There. Oh, that, yeah. <gasps> Vintage. So adorable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Having that Hipsters, spot. Hipsters. This is hipster gold. I would, know? If I saw that, I'd pick that up. Yeah, for sure. Um, 15 to 25 dollars yeah easy and then you know we got some cases um let's see there's some more in here that goes down too let's see what we got in here let's come out piece dancing 56 history of blue roy clark man he was a picker roy clark doctor who sound effects that could actually be worth some money. That's cool. That could legit be... I know Doctor Who fans out there go nuts for collecting stuff. That we're... Yeah, we might have to look that one up. That's we're, crazy. We're all over the place. With yeah, we stuff. literally... It's everything, huh? Now I, I want to dig more, right? I'm sorry, folks. I, I mean, I'm, I'm a record guy for funsies, and I get addicted. But it's just so different. Santa Claus is coming to town. That's an easy Christmas sale. If you ever... Oh, what do we got down here? I see some Elby. I see El Green Elvis. Oh, well, these are just covers. The animals. He's kept some parts. Oh, like you do to merge. So that make yeah, he probably was selling them. He might have been picking them up at yeah. yard sales or something. These are all parts. But they're good parts. Yeah, he's from our kind of group. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. Huh. Even the covers are really fun to go through. Is that rock? Midnight oil. Midnight oil. That's I in saw there. The back. Remember that? Yeah. Yeah, you could tell from the back of that cover. It's yeah. From the eighties. Mm -hmm. Wow, this is funky, man. Man, it is packed. I'm gonna say the forty fives and the records. Mm -hmm. Throwing away a lot of them, dollar, dollar, dollar. I'm gonna say there's five hundred or a grand here in records. And just records. Fives. With the amount. Five hundred right all day long. Yeah, I think that's fair. So we're looking at, you know, 500 plus in the generators, 500 in the speakers, 500 plus. You've got, we're, we're already into the 1500. That's a hundred bucks, 1600. We're already into almost two About grand. About two grand. Right here. Yeah, I think right so. Here. Oh, today is very good. Yeah. All day long. Ah, CDs. Oh, boy, crazy. we've been, if you've been watching my videos, I've been scoring CDs. This will tell us what kind of guy he was. Rock and roll. <laughs> oh, they're oldies. These are Got like the 60s. Vintage sex songs. What? Weird. This is like, uh, uh, what's the, what, this is like, um, what's the, that label? The, the, straight, the label that you have to order online. Oh, I know what you're talking about. This is like comedy and like the... Yeah, but the, those are like the ones you pay like 20 and 30 bucks yeah, for. Yeah, you can't get them in stores. Yeah. Like the Rhino and yeah. stuff like that. Look at that. Canadian Sweethearts. 
Richie, Richie Valens. Valens. Capital Steps Campaign. That's like a comedy album, yeah. Bobby V. This is interesting. Look how many's in here. It's probably all of them, yeah. Oh my god, I have been just scorned CDs lately. Last year we came across a handful maybe, and already we're in like thousands. Thousands, yeah. Intanuous, hey, old school. Yep. Yeah, I see the Rhino Texas label on Rock some of those. Valley. Rhino and Ace labels, that's I've right. I've got to figure these are three bucks a piece to five to ten to whatever. These are not normal, yeah. Yeah. These have to be looked up to see if they go on there. <laughs> mm -hmm. Gene Vincent. That is the, that's the mother load right there. If we have is some it? Gene Vincent stuff in here, Rockabilly Gold. I'm sure that that record, even online, is five bucks and it might be ten. Let's see. Traveling Ray. Huh. Wow, every sort of thing. No trash, folks. No trash. I can't wait to get to that. Look at all that. We're that just talking to Dwight Yoakam. Dwight Yoakam. So we got a country fan. Teenage Wolf Pack. That's a movie. Wow. If you hear that noise in the back, it's the trash collector picking up the trash at the facility. Right. So these are these small labels. Yeah, so some of these could actually be... These are ones you, you have to order good. on uh, yep. you know, eBay and catalog Amazon. and Amazon. Yeah, yeah, they're not cheap. If you followed my site, I've mentioned a few times that back in the day when I got started back in the day on Amazon. Mm -hmm. I used to do media, I used to CDs, DVDs, and, and workout videos and stuff, and I used to sell stuff like this. So when they were pumping back uh, 10, 12, 15 years ago, you could make top dollar. Yeah, I can tell you from knowledge of this. Yeah, there's a lot of one and two and three dollar stuff there, but I tell you, there's some ten dollar stuff here. I, I can tell you that just in there, yeah. If these are all CDs, oh my God, box sets and stuff. Box sets. There's at least a thousand dollars here. Wow, Rhino. Yeah, Three Stooges, isn't that kind of cool? Three Stooges. Rock and Bones, 1950s punk and rockabilly. Oh, this is a movie. Look at this. I know like it's a record set. <laughs> oh God, that British one. And there's more. I love this cover. Oh man, I have been on a media blitz the last couple of months. Yeah, we really have been. It's in this one. Oh my god! Rockabilly, rockabilly. Yes, more. Rio gone. Hot rod rockabilly. All right, let's 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 yeah, do a comp. Let's see. What Proofs in the pudding. eBay is gonna be the cheapest. Look at that, brand new. They sell for twelve bucks. Yeah, we figured five on the low side. 24. Somebody's so asking 24. That's a little high. Let's see what it goes for. Let's see what they've gone for. Never check. I mean, never assume they sell for that. You got to see what the sold price yeah, is. Yeah, you got to go for that green tag. Well, new, they're $12. Okay. Nine, new. A lot of uh, people from out of the country trying to sell them. So they're kind of rare. So that's 20 so bucks shipping, I, yeah. they got to be five bucks. That was what we thought on the low end, and if we're doing that with that box. And oof. so we've got three boxes of these, and we got one, two, three, four, five, 10, 10, 20, 30, 5, 70, uh, you know, 150, 200 times three, 600, 600 with an average of three bucks a piece, $1,800. And some are gonna be a lot more, and some. So there's is. a thousand minimum to two grand here. And just that one box, and we've got another box. So, but they all have to be looked but up. They this all, is, this mm -hmm. is time consuming. So, when you guys watch these videos and you see all these guys walk into these uh, storages or, or go to an estate and they buy all this uh, merchandise and they go, Oh, I just made a million dollars. Yeah, on paper. Yeah. Uh, you're going to be spending six months of your life or a year of your life listing everything and looking it up and finding somebody to buy it. It is not hard finding merchandise, mm -hmm. it's hard storing it and selling it. Uh, if you followed my site, you know that I dropped a chunk of change on a giant Elvis Presley collection. And that was a year ago coming up in about a month. Yeah. And I'm still working on that. Yeah. The, the profit is at the end here. So it's a job. It's a fun job. It's treasure hunting, but it's a job. So don't take it lightly. You can't get rich quick unless you just get dumb lucky. Yeah. But anyway, the, this is our first part of this video out of this room. But I mean, there's at least a uh, retail here of four grand. I think that's reasonable. Yeah, right? yeah, I think so. Uh, over time. Yeah. So I mean, we gotta we gotta move it. <laughs> yeah, there's time to uh, we have to sift through it and look it all up and list it and sell it. It's, it's a rainy to, weekend. That's when yeah, you do it. Rainy, it's a rainy. <laughs> it's a perfect it's time. A rainy month is yeah. what it is. But anyway, this is why you watch our channel. 
because we show you the real deal. And uh, I told you I'd tell you what I paid for it. I had to step up. I paid a grand. We're already just so the I'm front already half. Yeah. three to four times my money, and I just got the second half of it to go through. So don't miss so, that part. Uh, Stay with us, watch uh, the second or third video of this, and don't forget to subscribe. And if there's time, uh, if you're under 1,100 subscribers, our club. you're still in, uh, able to be entered for our gold, silver draw, drawing and our giveaway of toys and, and collectibles. So we're giving away 15 items out of 1,100. You have a one in 75, roughly, chance of winning. Yeah, that'll be a fun video, too. So thanks for joining us. We appreciate your time. We'll see you next time. See you guys.